Yo, it's your boy the Android Doctor back again with another video. Okay guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to install the official exposed framework for the Moto G5 um, running Android N. So the official exposed framework is now available to download. So I'm going to show you how to install it. But before I do that, I'm just going to explain that there's a few requirements. You will need to unlock your G5's bootloader and you will also need to root your G5 and have TWRP recovery installed. If you don't know how to unlock the, unlock the bootloader and how to install TWRP recovery and how to root the G5, I will leave links to all three of my tutorials in the description down below. Be sure to check them out. Um, get your bootloader unlocked to begin with, then install TWRP recovery, then root the device, then you can come back to this video and install the exposed framework. So um, I've already got root. So let me just show you that my G5 is rooted. As you can clearly see, properly rooted. Okay, so first things first, just head on to the link in the description down below. So head on to this link in the description down below and you're gonna want to download the exposed installer. So I've already downloaded it and it's on my desktop. Here it is, exposed installer. So just once you've downloaded it, just connect your phone to the USB cable. Let's just do that real quick. Select transfer files. Open up the SD card and put the exposed installer APK file onto there. Okay, so next you're going to go to the second link here. Uh, my device is running Android 7.0, so I'm going to download it from the second link. If your G5 is running 7.1, you're going to download the exposed installer from this link here. So like I said, I'm running 7.0, so I'm going to download it from the second link. And then I'm going to choose the ARM link here. And then download the zip file. I've already downloaded it, so I'm not going to download it again. So once you click on this link here, it will start to download. Save it to your desktop, like I've already done. Here it is. So once again, you're just going to open up your SD card. Hold on, where is it? And then you're going to drag and drop the exposed zip file onto your SD card. So you should have both those files on there, the exposed installer APK and the exposed VAA SDK24 ARM zip file on your SD card. You can go ahead and shut that down. Okay, now just put your phone, power it off. And now you need to put your phone into the fast boot menu. So to do that, you're just going to press in between the volume up and down button and the power button at the same time. You're just going to keep it held down for a couple of seconds, then let go. And it should then take you into the fast boot mode. And now we're going to go into the recovery mode. So just press the volume down button until you see the recovery option. Don't know if you can see it on the camera there recovery mode and then hit the power button to enter the recovery mode okay guys sorry about that I've just made a slight error all done let's just reboot just select reboot system and select do not install. So 
Sorry about that. I forgot we've got to install the APK file first. Okay, so make sure you've got a file manager installed. So if you don't have a file manager installed, just head on to the Play Store and download any file manager. And then um, go to your file manager. Here it is, here's mine. And look for the APK file, Exposed Installer. Just go ahead and install it. It might not allow you to install it. It might say something about going into the settings and um, you'll have to go into the settings and set the permission to allow the install. Um, so um, go ahead and hit install and then hit done. Okay, so now power off again and once again, you're going to press in between the volume up and down button and the power button. You're going to press both of them, keep it held down for a couple of seconds, and then it'll take you into the fast boot mode. Once again, press the volume down button until you see recovery mode, and then hit the power button to enter the recovery mode. Okay, before you actually do the install, I recommend just selecting backup and just swipe to do a backup of your current setup on your phone. Just back everything up just in case anything does go wrong. You can always go back into the recovery mode and restore the phone back to how it was. I just highly recommend doing that. Okay, so go ahead and hit install and select exposed VAA SDK arm.zip and swipe to confirm flash and just wait for it to say done and then go ahead and hit the reboot system option and then select do not install Okay, so the first boot is going to take a while. I'll be back once it's done. Okay, back again. So it's finished booting up. Okay, so let's go into the apps. Okay, so here we have the exposed installer. So just open it up. Select OK. And you should then see that the exposed framework is active. And you should see this green box with a little green tick there, which is a good sign. Okay, so here on the left, hold on. Let's just turn auto rotate off. 
Okay, so here on the left, if we select the options up here, we have modules. So no modules were found, that's because I've not downloaded any, I've just installed it. But once you download your modules, they'll show up in the modules there. If you select the download option, you'll find all the modules that you can download. So there's a very long list of modules you can download and install. install. As you can see there's loads to choose from. My favourite is the Instagram one. When you install that you can download videos from Instagram. So yeah, thanks for watching. This was just my quick tutorial video showing you how to install the Expose framework on the Moto G5. If you liked the video and it helped you out, you already know what to do. Be sure to give it a thumbs up. Leave any comments in the comment section down below. And thanks for watching. It's your boy, the Android Doctor. And I'm out. Doses.